Hello guys, last time I ordered Poppy Playtime on Wish, and this is what I got. Creepy bird. <laughs> ah! Now this time, I think I have the right one. It it's it's the first uh, chapter of Poppy Playtime, and um, I will be playing the second chapter next. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. Chapter 1, A Tight Squeeze. As an ex-employee of Playtime Co., you finally return to the factory many years after everybody within disappeared. Ooh. Um. Are those eyes? I see. Are those real eyes I see in th that, that thing? That huggy wuggy thing? Okay. Vidris. You are about to see. The most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Congratulations, you made an AI. Poppy's as lovable as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love you. Can you help me polish my shoes? Why, of course, Poppy. Just like a real girl, Poppy always wants to look her best. Perfect. Thank you. Her hair is sturdy and won't come out when you brush it, and smells just like a Poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Poppy? I'm a real girl. Just like you. What's the time? Okay. And if you've ever wanted to see how all of the nation's favorite toys were created, Playtime Co. is now offering factory tours at just $2.99 a person. An entire hour in the most magical toy factory on Earth. What are you waiting for? Come visit the factory. We can't... Okay, that does look like a poppy flower. But I don't think it'll be smelling very good. Poppy playtime. Yes, indeed. Everyone thinks the staff disappeared 10 years ago. We're still here. Find flower. The thing is, I already know of the game. And, um... Yeah, I, I've kinda just watched a video through on it but I uh forgot what happens here so I I guess I can play it again. I, I didn't know this game was free. Okay, so welcome. Let me put in the green tape. I have no idea what it says anymore anyways. So let me get a update on the lore! And I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent child care, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example, this facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, will turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And that's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. No spoilers. So, you've got my warning. It's not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. Okay. With security, he probably means... D huggy wuggy v that blue mascot thing that moves that we had in the beginning yeah th that's what he definitely meant okay staff only a staff only oh B cat B I remember that I have to look at colors of a train I guess red yellow pink green Hey, let me explore this first. Doesn't seem... There's nothing here, so... Except some toys. 
I guess there is a b boogie boy, I guess. And, um, well, le let me see those colors again. Red, yellow, pink, green. I wonder why I'm playing this game. I already saw a video about, about it's red, yellow, pink, green. Okay. Yep, that, it, that is it. it. Indeed. Okay. Now let me see what's on the tape. That's probably the grab pack thing, when I remember correctly. Grab pack. Tighten the strap. That's a nice tutorial, is it? Pull both hands. Pull the trigger to fire. Pull again to retract. Hold grip onto object. Only fire at small objects and handles. Do not fire at co workers. I I did not remember that. I, I certainly did not remember that. Thank you. Use your wrap pack responsibly. You are welcome. I will do that, I guess. Now now I'll get that grab pack. Yeah, nice, 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 nice. Okay. Now it's time for Ooh. Nice. Okay, anyways. Yep. Now now I need um this to open it. Um Hello, Huggy Wuggy. You're looking a bit different today. How about I give you a high five? No one ever gave you a high five, Huggy Wuggy. Huggy Wuggy, Playtime Co. has designed hundreds of distinctive toys, but none connected with the people more than that of Huggy Wuggy. Our founder, Elliot Ludwig, aimed to create a toy which could hug you forever, as is always true. Playtime Co. forced that process in most lifelike toys was a success. Interesting. Well, if it wants you to hug for your entire life, I guess that would be possible. With a bit of string and polyester out of our lovable blue hat, Huggy was brought to life. Huggy Wuggy has gone on to be Poppy Playtime Co.'s most popular and um, best-selling things so far yeah yes he definitely will st do that until you pop anyways let me do that Hmm? Where did that sound came come from? Oh, wait, what? Thanks for the key, Huggy Wuggy. Okay, now staff only. Let me go there, in there anyways. Okay, very interesting. What do I have to do here? I, I think I need to... Yeah, that's... Come on, let me... Good. Okay! Now let me do what I'm supposed to do. Yep. 
Yep, I'll do it around the corner. A toy covered in blood. I wonder what could have happened here. I wonder. Oh, huggy, 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 huggy. No, 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 no. You can't just disappear like that. No, 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 no. Okay, I I guess he's gone then. But I can now open this door. I guess. I know for a fact um, that we won't come back here. And okay. Uh oh. W what? What? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I'm not going in here. I I'm going back. I'm going back. Okay, I I'm going in there. I'm going in there. But first. Ah. I knew. Oh! I like to express how much I like, um long dark hallways on this channel i it's a love love relationship oh, no. okay hmm. okay very interesting huggy wuggy's not here yay good that is very, very good. Now, where's the tape? Is there a tape? I don't think so. Interesting. I think I gotta find every single one of them. <laughs> yep, I guess I gotta do that. I'll find that one. Um, there is a green one. After that, I need to find one more. There is a head of a baby. How very nice. Well, they deliberately just wanted to destroy that that stuff. Oh, there's yellow one. Come on, yeah, boy. Now I have all four of them. Can I? No. Okay, wait a minute. I think I have to force this op open somehow. Come on. Oh, this is how you open the door. Well, a head up would have been very, very nice. Now, hmm, is there an orange tape here somewhere? Ah, I, I think I almost got, oh wait, or does this? Oh, long dark hallway. Let me not go back. How about no, I don't go back. Okay, now that I have all of them, I am inevitable. Oh, come on. P pick that up. R Pick that shit up. Come on, you can do it. Oh no, I am not allowed to say that on YouTube now. But I can't get demonetized. So there's that. Oh, that's how you do it. I don't have to grab a pack with my grab pack. I guess. Okay. Now how do I crouch? How do I crouch? Yeah. That's how we do it. That's how I do it. That's how we 
who do it here on the channel. Okay. What do I do now? Grab to complete circuit. Ah, I see. Now I have to use two of them. Um, how do I go get up there though? Do I? Wait a second. No, no I, don't. I don't. Okay, that's how I get up here. That is how I get up here. Okay. Now let me go down there. And... Grab this. Yep, that's how it works. That is how it works. Yes, indeed. Now remember the... Oh. Okay, this is not the chase scene. I remember there being a chase scene on the conveyor belt. Ooh. Okay. I think Huggy Wuggy is going to appear here. Yeah, that's definitely. He's going to definitely appear over there. Now I have to make a friend. How do I make a friend? By building one, of course. Okay, this leads up to pink tape. Oh. I would have almost fallen. Wait. Oh, yeah, that's how it works. Oh, there is pink tape. Let me listen to that real quick. Couldn't find the orange one. So, Stella, what made you want to work at the Playtime Co. Factory? Playing with toys when I was young was so magical. I could go straight from my bedroom floor to anywhere in the world. It was such a great feeling. And being able to work at a toy factory, somewhere that can provide kids with that same experience, that's a pretty great feeling too. Sometimes though, I really, really wish I could go back. To being a kid, I mean. And it's weird, cause Adults are just kids, but older. I don't think anyone ever really feels like an adult. But your body just gets older and older, and then you die. Poof! <laughs> Human bodies just can't stay young forever. There's oh, space, you want to make an like infinite life glitch, are you? Being way older than the person. I mean, the oldest people to ever live are still younger than those. So I guess everyone is always young relative to something, right? Alright, I think we're getting a little off track. You are definitely getting a bit off track. You are very much getting off track. Okay, there is electricity. Wait, what's this? Oh. Yeah, won't I be electrocuting myself? I will not be questioning that. But anyhow... Um... That's what I have to do. And... Go over there, and... What's that? There is something over here. Three days later... So... That would let me go here, and that would let me go here and go there, and then what I can do is go there, go that way, and ah, uh, that's that's kind of cringe. Three weeks later. Okay, 
Wait a second. I, I think I can do it. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I, I've done it. I'd so much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Yep, I, I've now done it. I'm now done it. Yes. Let me jump down. That lags. Okay, anyways, power on. Ooh, shit, that scared me. <laughs> that did scare me. And now I can push the levers, I guess. They're lit up. Wait, let me... <clears throat> okay, now I can see how a cat bee is made, I guess. I wonder why those things still work. They did not destroy it. Or sells those things for scraps. They did actually nothing. They, they just left the factory and said, Ah, that, not my problem anymore. Okay, Cat B now has color. Now it's being assembled, I guess. Interesting way of assembly, gotta be honest. Yeah, that's uh, that is definitely the cat bee. Okay, and now I place the cat bee over there. Huggy Wuggy will not chase me, will it? It it, it won't just um pop out of there, will it? Oh hell no! Okay, I have to go over there. Okay, chase scene. Ah! No no no! Okay, Huggy Wuggy's now in vents. Okay, no, no, no. No, no, no. 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 Okay. I think I... No, I didn't get away. No. Please don't kill me. Ah! Get up. Let me do that again. Okay. Okay. Now let me simply go over here. No, 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 no. Okay. Danger. I hope. No, no, no. Please, please do not. Please do not catch me. What? Okay. No. No. Please. Please. Stop danger. I don't care. There is a freaking monster chasing me. Oh. Okay. Box.
Okay. Good. That is very good. Let me just... Um... Go... Somewhere... Where I don't see that little shit. Black tape. But, but I think he's already dead, so... I don't know. Why is why is there a TV dangling? Wherever? I, I don't know. Let me put the tape in. Final log in relation. Experiment 1006. The prototype. Coordination and cooperation is evidently within his skill set, as well as the skill set of all other experiments of his type. Though still missing, today's events are no doubt in relation to him. His absence was a flaw in the scientific process, which should have under no circumstances been left unaccounted for. That's why I'm making this log, so that the same mistake won't be made twice. Any future experiments will need to be contained and disposed of in a secure location. I'm not worried about myself. One breakthrough and I'll be back. We must forge onwards in the name of science. Whether those who are beneath us understand it or not, end of... Is that guy died i don't think if you're um referring to um the, the, the huggy wuggy as 1006 he does not have cooperation in his skill set i think Okay, let, let me let me just let me just go somewhere where I don't die. A random door over here. Hey, look! Why don't I open that door and go in there? Because nothing bad's going to happen. Poppy. Hello. Um, should I open? Nah, nah, nah. I'll be fine. I I'm just going to go back and. But uh, wait a minute. There's, n there's nothing. I, I can't go back. I have to open the case. How about I open the cover for first? No. Okay, well, I'll do it then. Uh oh. My case. Yes, I uh, certainly did. Now, don't kill me. Well, that was a pretty interesting game. Even though I watched a YouTube video about it like a year ago, I don't remember anything. So, I actually just remember that there's Huggy Wuggy and other stuff. A bit. Yeah, but that, that was that that was some scary shit. I gotta say. So, next time I'll be playing Chapter 2. Which I haven't watched a video about or anything. So, I guess is a bye-bye then. Bye.